Navy's Location Intelligence Teaching Area is for students who want to prepare to make a deep and meaningful impact on the management of modern organizations. Location Intelligence is the latest development in the long history of the application of geography to complex problems that relate to both human activity and geographic space. Such problem-oriented application spans a wide range of human activities, from public sector and non-profit initiatives to profit-seeking business. Businesses in particular have found a wide range of valuable benefits from the application of location intelligence principles to analysis and improvement of their operations. The retail sector was one of the early adopters of geographic expertise. In a retail context, location intelligence collects and synthesizes the technological tools, advanced data sets, and proven applications that geographers have developed and mastered over the years. These tools and applications have a track record of providing retail business with input that helps them make better strategic decisions related to business locations and markets. The screen shown here illustrates a basic application, how one GIS package geocodes or maps the Dallas-Fort Worth locations of a large department store chain. Mapping store locations on its own provides some insight into the business's facility network. However, beyond mere store locations, the analysis goes a step further by also defining the drive time zones that the chain is serving through its store network. Drive time zones represent the geographic area that is within a given automobile travel time of a store or other location. This travel-based buffer analysis defines the local markets that are located within a series of three increasing drive times of an individual store location, 10, 20, and 30 minute travel times. Such analysis opens the door to assessment of which communities are best served by the store network and analysis of whether there are neighborhoods that would be great markets for the chain but are actually served very poorly by the chain's existing store locations. Geography is also a key part of smart planning for non-retail services such as restaurants. The geographic analysis reflected here provides a simple indication of the zone served by each restaurant in a larger chain. In this case, the analysis is using one of the most simple market zone definition methodologies, the Thiessen Polygon approach. While not appropriate for detailed analysis, Thiessen Polygons are a great tool for an, an initial analysis such as this. As well as indicating service zones by restaurant location, this map goes a step further by indicating recent sales changes visually connecting restaurant performance with the zone served by each restaurant. The connection of rich customer data sets already owned by the business with geographic data defining market characteristics is one of the strongest areas of location intelligence application. This analysis can be taken even further by connecting high sales restaurant zones with the characteristics of the zones that can account for their great sales performance. Attention to geography is also a crucial ingredient for efficient transportation and logistics planning. Transportation is inherently geographical so place and space must be taken into account in order to develop good strategies for any transport-related operations. 
Let's take a quick look at a scenario that illustrates some potential issues and solutions. The problem here involves the logistics company's existing delivery infrastructure and their need to better serve their customer base. This initial map shows their first two delivery depots in red and their widespread customer base. Each green dot represents a customer. The issue? The two existing depots in the city only effectively serve a fraction of the business's local delivery customers. This is reflected in this map, which indicates the drive time delivery zones connected with the two existing depots cover only a portion of the city. The challenge? How to identify the best locations for more delivery depots to better cover all customers. Location intelligence can solve this problem and help the logistics company plan efficient operations by using a set of methodologies known as location allocation modeling. Location allocation modeling simultaneously calculates efficient facility-centered service zones together with strategic locations. Location allocation modeling is a great example of a powerful spatial methodology that produces extremely practical results. In this particular case, location allocation modeling helps the company make strategic selections from a roster of potential depot locations that the company has identified. Here, location allocation identifies the best five locations to add to the company's first two depots to provide the biggest possible increase in customer service. In an era of increasing threats, global commerce, travel, insurance, and investment companies need to pay attention to the impact of location on portfolio risk. Risk assessment includes many factors but one that is particularly important is location. For example, risk linked to hurricane threats varies dramatically with location, with coastal zones in certain regions bearing a much higher risk than interior zones in other regions. Exposure to insurance claims for a specific event is a related issue. For any given insurance event, Insurance companies need to gather information on their level of exposure to claims in a comprehensive and rapid manner. Here is a tornado focused example. This map reflects the tracks followed by a system of tornadoes as they cross a city. The map illustrates the tornado impact paths that experienced high levels of damage. Creation of this impact tracking map makes it possible to cross-reference impact path data with a database of property insurance policy holders for an insurance company. Doing this allows the insurer to gain a quick perspective on the magnitude of the company's exposure to this weather event. Having this analysis helps the insurer to prepare for the financial consequences of the tornado system. Companies seeking to do highly targeted marketing campaigns also need to consider the geography of their current and potential customers. The straightforward goal here is to concentrate marketing efforts on communities that represent known, excellent markets for the business and to avoid communities that are lesser markets for the company's offerings. This display shows another GIS software package that includes a powerful user interface allowing the analyst to define a very specific target market profile based on several different variables. Location intelligence can use such a segmentation system in conjunction with a business's customer database to provide extensive insights into who the business's customers are and to find more clients like the best ones the business currently has. In summary, location intelligence is about a broad perspective on the practical application of geography to help business leaders make the best decisions possible. 
All of the location intelligence application areas we have explored here combine the latest geospatial technologies with a body of knowledge that has been developing for centuries. Please contact me if you have any questions about any of the courses we offer related to location intelligence and business geography in UNT Geography and the Environment.